Montreal health officials are blaming the heavy heat and humidity for at least six deaths in recent days. Dermaline Drun told a news conference the deaths have been investigated and are linked directly to the heat wave. Officials in Montreal say six deaths are linked directly to days of hot weather in the region. Wibbits, the Canadian press, drew and says the victims fit the profile of people authorities describe as at risk of those with chronic illness or mental health problems, people who live alone and people without air conditioning at home. She says there has also been a rise in the number of calls to ambulance services in recent days and that the city wants to avoid what happened in 2010, when intense heat claimed 106 lives. More than 15,000 homes and businesses in Quebec were still without power and air conditioning Tuesday afternoon following violent storms. Temperatures were in the low 30s. Article continued Bella was at 2 p.m., 15,234 Hydro-Quebec customers were blacked out, mainly due to fallen trees and branches on power lines. About 8,000 of the outages were in the Laurentian region north of Montreal and in the Lanaudière area northeast of the city. Hydro-Quebec said nearly 163,000 customers were without power at the peak of the outages Monday night. The utility said some people will not have power back before the end of the day Wednesday. The oppressive weather has enveloped much of central and eastern Canada since the Canada Day long weekend. People use misters to cool down in Montreal, Monday, July 2, 2018, during a heat wave that officials have blamed for at least six deaths. Graham Hughes, the Canadian press, Environment Canada says Humidex readings were to be in the 40C range Wednesday from southwestern and northeastern Ontario through southern Quebec and into the Atlantic region. The weather agency says a very warm and humid air mass has settled over the maritimes and above normal temperatures and humid conditions will stick around into Thursday. Maritime temperatures are expected to return to seasonal normals for the weekend. Article continued Bella a hot and humid air mass is also entrenched over southern Quebec, with Tuesday's highs expected to be in the low 30s with a humid X reading between 35 and 40 C, also through Thursday. Southern Quebec was rocked by violent storms on Monday, leaving thousands of homes and businesses without electricity, or air conditioning. Most of the outages were in the Outaway region of western Quebec in addition to areas north and northeast of Montreal. Environment Canada said much of southern Ontario, including Toronto, also remains under a heat warning, with a humid X reading peaking at 43 Tuesday. The extreme heat is expected to ease off on Friday with the passage of a cold front in western Alberta. Meanwhile, the problem is rain and lots of it. As of late Monday, about 3 centimeters. Rain had fallen in the Jasper region, creating the possibility of flooding in low-lying areas. Environment Canada said another 2.5 to 5 centimeters were expected before it tapers off Wednesday morning.